Hello. I'm back. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Uh, sorry that it's been quite a while since I last uploaded a YouTube video. Uh, I've just been really busy with work. However, this whole week, uh, I'm staying at a friend's house. As you can probably tell, this is not my usual studio space. And I thought I would get a lot of YouTube uh, content out. So uh, the next few videos will be in this sort of setup. Uh, which I quite like. Just going off what I was talking about work, uh, that's kind of the main topic of today's video, is, you know, I'm coming up on a year of me uh, being uh, the boss of my own company. I have learnt things over that time, and I kind of wanted to tell all of you about the stuff that I've learnt over the course of a year. So, this video is my top three tips on how to become a better creator and the things that will help you grow and become greater at the stuff that you enjoy. So, tip number one is to make yourself as available as possible. And what I mean by that is just kind of say yes. 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 To things, because you don't really have anything to lose. So, you know, if we, if we take Instagram, for example, the amount of stories that I see for events that are happening and opportunities to be with like-minded people who enjoy the same thing as you do, you know, I, I see it everywhere. And instead of just kind of going, eh, it looks all right. I'm sure I'll head to it in the future. I'm sure it will come up again. Just jump at it because it's really going to help you become a greater creator. <laughs> That's clever, greater creator. And you will learn things from other people that you didn't necessarily know before. Tip number two is kind of continuing on from just saying yes to opportunities and that's making people trust you. So take a scenario where you've headed out, you know, you've seen a thing on your story and you've headed to that event and other people have seen what you're capable of. Those people could ask you if you would be interested in helping them out on other projects. This happens to me quite a bit. Um, so for example, I have been recently helping out a creator called Keith um, on YouTube. He's called Keithicus Entertainment, if you're interested in his work, because it is mint. Um, he's a fantastic cinematographer and because I've been hanging out with him more and more, he's been able to see what I'm capable of and he's asked me to help him out on his own client shoots. And you just want to build that trust because, you know, he asked me to help out on a gym shoot and he's like closer to Bristol, he's in Bridgewater, uh, and I was in Portchester, which is miles away, like a three hour trip away. And I had other stuff to do uh, on that day, so I had to get up at half four in the morning just so I could get over there to be with him at like two o'clock. And that's quite a few trains, but I made sure that I was there so that he can trust me because I'm trying to become a better cinematographer. I love photography, but I want to become a better cinematographer and that's why I'm putting all my time and effort into. And Keith is giving me all these opportunities and it's because he's seen what I'm capable of and I want him to trust me. So if you want to become a better creator, tip two is have people put their trust in you. And finally, tip number three is to not feel intimidated. And this kind of goes hand in hand with tip one about just heading out to events and saying yes. There are gonna be other creators who are better than you and it can feel intimidating to go to an, an event or hang out with other creators and to try and prove yourself almost. I was in that position once where I hadn't ever been with any other creator and I wanted to improve. 
all of my skills so I just had to take that leap and go out and be with other like-minded people and it is scary it is intimidating but you need to take that stride to become better at what you enjoy because you know even after god six years of doing photography and cinematography i'm still heading out with other creators to events uh most recently since things have eased up now i'm heading more and more to the uk shooters events you know i've been to the uh bentley meetup um, i've just been to a halloween one and it was incredible because there's all these opportunities to take pictures of things that you haven't taken pictures of and it will just increase your skills over time and you'll just get better and better and better but you have to take that first step so that's it for me coming back to YouTube uh, for a bit of time. I don't know how long it'll last, uh, but I'm gonna try and push out as much content as possible. As always, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers, guys.